Hello YouTubers, this is Jordan Blakey, the liver flush man here, today with another amazing video. This is video 20 of 1,000 videos in three years, and this video is on eight natural heavy metal chelators. Alright, what is a chelator? A chelator is something that bonds the a metal ion, heavy metals, it bonds the heavy metals and carries that out the body. All right, flushes it out the body. It bonds the heavy metals. So um, I'm going to describe eight. I uh, talk about eight different natural chelators. First is natural sea salt. Um, natural sea salt is not white refined sea salt. Um, this is called also called ancient solar sea salt, deposited over two million years ago. Examples of this kind of sea salt is. Himalayan sun-dried sea salt, Celtic sea salt, dead sea salt, Atlantic sea salt, any of the ancient solar salts that were deposited over two million years ago contain a high concentration of iodine and iodine is a natural chelator of heavy metals. So sea salt number one. Number two, seaweeds from the sea. About 99% of all seaweeds are edible from the ocean. Um, kelp has the highest concentration of iodine out of any of the seaweeds, but all seaweed contains a nice amount of iodine. So that's a natural source of iodine that chelates the heavy metals. So number one, sea salt. Number two, seaweeds. Number three, chlorophyll and chlorella. They're basically the same thing. Uh, chlorophyll is what is made through the photosynthesis of sunlight. Um, and that is a chelator of heavy metals as well. So you can buy chlorophyll in a bottle concentrated, a green, a green uh, liquid that's like green um, chlorophyll. Um, that's really good. Just drink back some of that and that's going to help flush the heavy metals out of your body. Corella is also similar to spirulina. Corella is a blue-green algae. Um, so that's really good. That's number three. Uh, cilantro number four. Cilantro is a really good chelator but it also crosses the blood-brain barrier. So when you take cilantro you're detoxing heavy metals out of your brain as well because it is able to cross the blood brain barrier. So that's number four. Then we got um, food grade activated charcoal. This is an amazing chelator of heavy metals as well. It bonds the heavy metals and flushes them out the body. Number six, bentonite clay, both internal and externally. Internal, take a, tea, a tablespoon with a glass of water and externally take a bath with bentonite clay in your bath. That's going to chelate heavy metals. Number seven, spirulina, similar to the chlorella and the chlorophyll. Uh, spirulina, it's, it's not as powerful as a chelator as the iodine from sea salt and kelp, but it is, uh, it, it, it does still chelate heavy metals. And then number eight, onions and garlic with the sulfur-bearing compounds in there. That flushes heavy metals out the body as well. So there's eight sources of natural, natural sources of um, natural chelators of heavy metals. Now some sources of heavy metal contamination are like dental amalgam fillings, the ones with mercury lead and stuff like that. Um, for the fillings, the silver ones, um, bottom fish feeder and other fish in the sea that can get uh, heavy metals in the meat, um, contacts lens solution, um, disinfectants, vaccines, injections, old lead water pipes, uh, employment in the chem chemical industry, electric industry and mining industry, as well as different kinds of paints and the list goes on to different like arsenic from rat poisoning um, 
is the list goes on about how we are subject ourselves to heavy metals and so we need to be constantly chelating heavy metals out of our body by including these kinds of foods these are the natural ways of chelating heavy metals from the body so I just wanted to give you a little bit of informa information about naturally chelating heavy metals from the body. Thanks for watching. I'm Jordan Blakey, the Liver Flesh Man. We'll see you next time.